Well, some of the most famous artists in the world currently have works of display on at the Washington Pavilion in Sioux Falls. Capital Land's Travis Fossing shows us what Guildhall Adventure in Arts has to offer. The Washington Pavilion is hosting its first major traveling art exhibit in five years. It's 72 pieces from the permanent collection of the Guildhall Museum in East Hampton. Original works created by some of the country's most celebrated artists. Jackson Pollock, Roy Lichtenstein, Robert Rauschenberg, Andy Warhol. And in a room full of famous artwork. The one that we've really been pushing is the Andy Warhol Marilyn Monroe piece. It's a beautiful screen print that is just a really iconic piece of work by Andy Warhol. I'm huge anything Warhol, Lichtenstein, pop art. We do that a lot in our class, so I really wanted the kids to get to see it. Laura Sasky is an artist and teacher in Homer, Nebraska. Her class made a special trip to Sioux Falls to see the exhibit. There is a lot of different styles out there that it's not just realism and simple, you know, same style, everything is different out there. So I want them to get to see what other kind of art there is. The exhibit is a walk through time dating back to the 1800s and includes Thomas Moran, whose claim to fame is painting images of Yellowstone, which led to it becoming a national park. This show shows about 100 years of American art history. The whole show tells the story of how art and art movements in America specifically became what it is since 1890 up until present day. Anderson says it's a show that's well worth your time. You can see them in New York City, you can see them in LA and all over the world, uh, but to see them here in Sioux Falls, South Dakota is just really, really special for us. In Sioux Falls, Travis Fossing, Kelloland News. Guild Hall at Adventure in Arts runs through Sunday inside the Visual Arts Center at the Washington Pavilion. We provided the link with complete exhibit details under this story on Kelloland.com.